Welcome to episode number seven of the Survey to Go basic training. My name is David and I'm going to be your host and I'm one of the scripting managers here in Dublo. And today we're going to uh, wrap things up with looking at BlueStacks and how you can use that as a scripter to actually test your scripts on an Android. And we'll look at BlueStacks and how you install Survey to Go on a BlueStack. Um, and then, of course, how to actually deploy our demo survey and um, see it right there on the device. So step number one would be to actually uh, download BlueStacks. And um, basically, it's just going to www.bluestacks.com. It's actually a free app that you can install on your PC. And it turns your PC into a Android uh, tablet, which is pretty cool. And you just click on the download for PC and uh, it's not made by Dublo, it's made by a company called BlueStacks and you're free to download that. So once you download uh, BlueStacks, you essentially get to the uh, BlueStacks app, which is right here. And um, this is an Android um, tablet for um, everything you need. So this is a true Android. It's not a mimicking, it's actually an Android running on your PC. So step number two would be to install survey to go on this Android. And to do that, it's um, uh, fairly simple. And here's how you go about doing that. So the first step will be to go to uh, our support center in order to get the link to download the uh, installation APK. The only thing you need to do in here is writing Android install, clicking on enter, and then selecting the installing survey to go for Android link. Next, you want to scroll down all the way to the end and click on the um, APK link. So I'll click on that and that will download the APK right to my downloads uh, section. And um, by the way, if um, you want to have a step by step guide to what I'm doing now, you can just go back, select install Android. And you have a link on how to install survey to go on BlueStacks. So I'm going to do that right now. I'm going to um, click on show and folder. And then I have this right here. And the next thing I want to do is go to the BlueStacks folder on your C drive program file files. You'll see BlueStacks here. And then you have this APK handler exe and what you want to do is essentially just drag this apk onto the apk handler and that just goes ahead and installs the apk on the bluestacks and once you do that you'll see that you have the survey to go app right there on your uh, bluestacks and when you click on that it will just open up survey to go so the next step would be to take this survey, which is currently in draft mode, and get it deployed to our tablet. So step one, number one would be to decide which uh, surveyor is going to get this uh, survey. And for that, I'm going to go to the actual management tree. Under my customer and project, I want to go into the uh, episode six, which holds the uh, completed questionnaire. And we have the surveyors node right here. I'm going to expand this. And I'll right click and click on add surveyor and we'll create just a new user for that. You don't have to do that if you already have a test user. I'll just click on create new surveyor user and I'll call this user um, student one. And I'll give it the password one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four. I'll click on create that will create my user and also selects it so I'll click on OK and I'll just double make sure that the um, student one appears here in the surveyors note so now we have this um, student surveyor user um, and he's assigned to this project the next thing would be to mark this project that it can be deployed so to do that, we just switch from the draft mode to either test or production. We recommend first switching to test, making all the uh, test interviews, checking out everything is in order, 
and only once you're ready to go out in the field to switch it to production because once you switch over to production the interviews start taking off credits from your account and uh, probably you want to just test so we'll leave it at test mode i'll click on ok but bear in mind both in test and production mode the actual survey will be deployed to the tablet and you'll be able to complete interviews so now it's in test mode i'll switch back to the blue stacks and we'll log in using student one the password one two three four and then the organization is aa market research inc i'll click on login it'll connect and start syncing and once it's done oh there's a new version out so that that'll happen uh, pretty often uh, if your organization is set for a uh, newer version uh, it will automatically uh, upgrade so we'll click on yes because why not get the latest version so it's up updating the version once it will stop uh, we'll click on yes to actually go ahead and upgrade so we'll click on an install it's installing and a new version is there so let's start it up again we'll log in sorry let's put in the correct password and we'll log in again and so now everything is up to date and we see our demo vehicle survey so we can actually um, click on that and start testing right there uh, using BlueStacks now the nice thing about BlueStacks is that it actually supports everything that you have in your tablet so if you have a webcam it'll actually snap photos if you're doing silent recording it will actually record uh, it has a gps set so you can actually test out pretty much everything you need right there on your blue stack so that's a very good alternative to a physical tablet if you're um, want to save up on device costs and it's actually a very productive tool in order to speed up your testing instead of going back and forth between the different tablets so I hope you enjoyed this uh, short series about scripting and in our next series we're actually going to do a full hands-on course of survey to go as this was just a brief um, quick get up and running guide. We're going to do a full length course probably a couple hours long to cover every detail and every aspect of the scripting, the different functions, the different question types and other more advanced topics. So stay tuned and I hope you um, join us with our next episodes.